guys, what's up? It's Louie. And Jaden. With Perfected Precision Gaming. We're finna doing another unboxing video for this um this month. And this month's unboxing is for Loot Crate. We just got um July's box today. Um and the theme for this box is uh futuristic. So futuristic. hopefully futuristic, yeah, futuristic. So hopefully we got some cool things in this box for futuristic. Um, that could be anything, man. So, what are you what are you anticipating is in the box for this um this month? A Back to the Future, or either either like something with Dragon Ball Z, like Future Trunks or something. Future Trunks. Oh well, I mean it is future, right? Yeah. So anything could be in here. Um, he's maybe right about the Back to the Future stuff. I don't know. So let's get into the unboxing and check out what's in the box. Um, I do these videos monthly, and what Loot Crate is is a monthly subscription box that sends you um some goodies. Um, and there's always a theme to these boxes. I think last last what was last month's theme? I'm not, I think it was um, Dystopia, Dystopia, right? I didn't know what that was. And this month's theme is uh, Futuristic. So every month they have no, a dystopia theme. Dystopia was the Marvel contest. No, the Marvel con No, it wasn't. Dystopia, it doesn't even matter. Well, anyway, yeah, the boxes are themed every month. And um, they come with some cool items. So let's get into the unboxing. I just got this today. And let's see what's in it. Hopefully there's some cool things in it this month. Okay, we open it. Pop the seal there on that bad boy. Okay, so we... Oh, look, that looks dope already. Look, check out the box already. Sick, sick box. Look at it, Dan. Okay, so there's a shirt, obviously in the box this month. What is? It looks like it's glow in the dark. So let's first let's get into this. Um, Mega Man. Mega Man. Look, a little Mega Man thing of a Okay, so we got a uh, possibility of getting. Um, the. I don't know who these people are, but let me let me get the name here. Two, two, two out of twenty. There's possibly. Yeah, so that's. Jeanette I don't see the names on them, but I don't. I don't know. So these guys here. You can you can get all of these guys here or these guys over there. So who do you want? I want, I want, I want the red, I want the um, red Mega Man. You want the blue Mega Man. I would like, um, do I like the red Mega Man? Yeah, the red Mega Man is dope. So I'm going to go ahead and open this one. Cross fingers, hopefully we get something cool. The red one is the one with the fire. With the fire? Yeah. yeah. Let's see, let's see what we get. Oh, the box is cool. The box is cool, I like that blue and, uh, that blue and green. We got in this little thingamajig here, so we got in this. This is from Kid Robot, by the way. Kid Robot? Kid Robot, yeah. Yeah, that's from Kid Robot. I'm gonna open this box, I'm not gonna tell you what's in this. I'm not about to open this with my teeth. It messed up my teeth, this is... That's not a word, don't say that, don't repeat it. Okay, so we got... Oh, look! Ah, uh, exactly what I wanted! Is it, is it orange or is it red? It's red. Oh, look at that! Man, I called it, baby! So we got the um the red Mega Man. I don't know the name of it. I don't even know. I think he just shoots fire out of his uh his blaster. So yeah, boy. So that's the first thing we got in the box for this uh this month. So so far, so good. Happy about that. So let's look at the pin for this month. Let's check out the pin for this month. The pin for this month is uh it says Star Trek on online loop pins, July 2016. The theme is futuristic. And where do we open it at? Uh, so, all right. So look. Check it out there. For the song at uh, Star Trek. I never watched Star Trek um, growing up or anything like that, or even Star Wars. Yeah, I never watched Star Wars or Star Trek. So I know that, uh, but I, I definitely know that that's the sign for Star Trek. Do the sign like this with me. You can do it. Can you do it? Yeah, go to the camera. Ah, so Star Trek. Yeah. So that's a Star Trek uh, pin for this month for futuristic. And it's golden, uh, like golden white, I guess. Yeah, golden white. Okay. So let's get the things. Before we get into the two biggest items, let's get into this on the bottom here. This is a uh, Star Trek The Next Generation. Loot Crate exclusive, I have no idea what this is. It's like in some slip. Let's open it and find out. This is what we're here for, right, Jada? Hmm? What are we here for? Okay, this is the US, it says USS Enterprise Galaxy Starfleet Registry. I have no idea. Is it a magnet? It's not, it's like a sticker. It's like a little sticker, Star Trek Generations. Um, I guess we'll look in the thing of a jig later and find out exactly what it is. But it has some sticky, so I guess you can stick this somewhere. Yeah, you can stick it somewhere. But look at that. I'm not gonna read everything it says because it's a lot. So I don't know. I'll find out what that is from the little um the little cheat um cheat thing that we got. Okay, so this is a um oh well, this is a nice box. Whatever it is, I hope it's something nice inside because oh, the box is really from, nice. Um, this, this is something from Futurama, yeah I know Futurama. It's by uh Planet Planet Express ship. It's a loop rate exclusive. Um, Mini Masters uh, vehicle. So I guess it's that little ship there from Futurama. I thought, I thought, when I looked at it, I thought it was a, the something from the Planet Sheen. It's an old show. So, oh, Planet Sheen. I know Planet Sheen. That's that show with that the little funny kid that's loud, right? Yeah. Yeah, so it's a ship from um, Futurama. I thought it was Let me get it over here. Kind of hard. There's a tape on there? Yeah, there's tape on there. So, 
batteries. Just gotta cut this out. We're working on it, we're working on it. Oh, that's poke. That's poke. Yeah. Yeah, that yeah, is poke, right? So yeah, we got the shit part here, and there's a little stand thing on that you can just stand it up. Hopefully I don't break it, I'm trying to get it out. So this part goes into, this is your stand right here, your little uh, clear, come on, go in, dude. Don't play me, don't play with me. There you go. And then the ship goes into here, so the magnet, oh, that's dope, it's a magnet, so look at that. So we got a little Futurama ship. On it, it says Planet Express, us so uh, reliable. Interplanetary delivery, serving the Milky Way and beyond. Right down there, right chair. Yeah, so we got a little ship. So, so far we got Mega Man, a little ship, and um, the Star Trek Enterprise thing we'll do, and the pen. So the next thing in the box that we're gonna get into is the comic book. The comic book is for, uh, it says 400 AD. It's a variant, variant one. Check it out. I don't know what that is. Who is that guy? I don't know. So we don't know who it is. Maybe you guys in the, um, can tell us in the description below or um, in the comments below um, who this is because we don't know who this is. 401 or is it 4001 AD by Matt Kent, Clayton Crane, and David Mack. Variant number one. So let us know in the comments below who is this uh, who is this uh, person here on this comic. I'm not going to open it because I don't like to mess them up and open them. Okay. So I think the last thing in the box is the shirt. So yeah, so let's get right into the shirt. The shirt is for, it's like a bluish shirt with the green and the, um, just like the box almost. Oh, I got it backwards, I got it backwards. Who is it on the shirt, Jaden? What is it on the shirt? It's a nice shirt though, I like the coin colors on it. This is, um, it looks like some futuristic kind of robot thing on the jig, but I have no idea what it was. This looks like a brain. This looks like some robot device. Dad, yes. You said you were gonna get the shirt in my box. No, because I gotta get a new box, Jaden. Oh. Okay, so I don't know what the shirt is, but let's look at the um the cheap book and find out exactly what the shirt is. Okay, we are looking in the book to find out what it is. So we've already established that um this is the future Futurama uh exclusive Futurama Planet Express ship model. Okay, that's what that is. That's this thing magic here. Key. And then we have, um, let's see, I'm dying to know what that shirt is. Oh, look, you can co color that in. Rick and Morty. They got a coloring page in here for the, um, for the kids, the kiddies. Or adults, some people like the color. So, a uh, three inch Mega Man red variant figure from Kid Robot. So, he actually is always red. I guess everybody's getting the same one, which is good. So, Kid Robot, uh, three inch Mega Man red variant. The next thing in the box is, um, Okay, so we're gonna find out what's on that comic comic book. Va Valiant Comics 400 AD Valiant Comics. Valiant's recent resurgence into reader and critical acclaim may have caught you off guard, so we're kickstarting your collection with a variant cover. Valiant, I guess that's what it is. I'm, I don't know. I don't know what it is. So, yeah, I guess it looks cool. He has a sword in his hand. So where's the shirt at? Did they talk about the shirt, Jaden? No, did we miss it? Daddy messed this up. I, I didn't see the shirt. And that's exactly what I, I mean, main reason why I opened this was to find out what the shirt was about. So I cannot find anything about a shirt. Oh no, I don't know. Look, Rick and Morty. Rick and Morty. Was that a show? That's on TV? Yeah, so I don't know. See, this is the, um, the USS Star Trek dedication plaque replica detail. So that's, and that's the pin there. Did I miss the shirt, guy? I think I missed the shirt. Okay, here goes the shirt right here. Oh, it's a Rick and Rick and Morty tee. It says Rick Rick's portal gun, arguably his most important invention, is it is the subject of the study on this blue heather tee. If you're able to replicate this tech, please dim, dimension hop responsibly. Okay, so that's that's Rick and um uh, Rick and Morty t-shirt. Okay, so what's your favorite thing? This is the loot crate uh Loot Crate, uh, bigger box right there. His favorite thing is the Mega Man. His favorite thing is the Mega Man. I do like the shirt, and I also like the Mega Man. I'm not, I don't know what Rick and Morty is, but I like the colors of the shirt. The colors of the shirt are dope. I don't have a shirt that's this, like, green with the blue and black. So, these are my two favorite items. Anything else you like in the box? I used to watch Futurama a little, you know, some time ago. So, this is, this is pretty dope. So, yeah, all in all, the box is a good box. So let's put the box together and see how this box looks. I like the, um... 
the theme of the box. I like how it looks. I like the colors that they decided to use for the um, We got it, yes. So this is the box for um this is how the box lo looks for the um futuristic says futuristic here. Then we have um landing zone, landing zone here on this side. Yeah, but the colors and all is it's for the uh adult box. So um thank you for watching our um loot crate uh video for this month. I appreciate you guys checking out our videos uh every month on this channel. Um, continue to look out for videos. We're coming to you with more videos with Loot Crate, um, some different gaming videos, and tech, um, technology videos. Um, anything to say? Peace. <laughs> hey guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoy my content, follow me on my other platforms on Facebook at PPG Gaming, on Twitch at Perfected Precision Gaming, and on Twitter at PPG Gaming 2586. And also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Later, guys.